Do the people know? Do they know what we're making? I hope so. If they looked at the title and the thumbnail. Oh yeah, I guess so. I hope that I <laughs> I hope that I labeled it and made a thumbnail accurate enough. Me too, man. I've been doing this for a while now. So. I hope future Craig's got it under control. <laughs> So if this is your first time watching, cold water on your hands makes corn syrup not stick to them as nearly as much. Cold water is magic. Yeah. And for people wondering why you can uh, pick up corn syrup, it's not like maple syrup. <laughs> it's a little bit thicker. It's pretty thick stuff, yeah. yeah. People always ask also why not dump it. Because it would take too long. Yeah, it take three days. Yeah, it does not dump like you would maple syrup. <laughs> and you can't stop it in time. Then you yep. put too much in there. And then you got to grab it with your hands to get it out. Yeah. So you guys <laughs> always do it with your hands. Yeah. <laughs> and people also had really genius idea the last time, or the second to last video. I'm trying to think of the order that we had videos up. Because uh, we had really tiny bags of sugar, because BJ's oh. was out of sugar. So they're like, why don't you guys use bigger bags? Well, we would if we had access to them. Sometimes they don't have big yeah. bags and we take what we get. Yeah, well, because people always ask why not order from like a big distributor and it's, for whatever reason, it's actually cheaper to go to BJ's. Yep, it's cheaper and uh, uh, quicker and easier for us. It's only uh, half a mile away and uh, they store all the sugar instead of us storing it all. Yeah, and we were lucky enough to be able to get big bags of sugar this time. Yep. <laughs> Well, I can see the sugar like, I don't know if they can see it on camera, but it's like floating in the air. <laughs> taste it. Yeah. <laughs> the air tastes sweet. It really does, yeah. Sugar has a totally different taste when it's in the air. Yeah. It sounds funny. Though. When you're breathing it in. Yeah. I got that sugar lung. <laughs> uh, so that's cream of tartar too. <laughs> I might have the white lung. <laughs> Yeah, cream turner and water. Secret ingredients. <laughs> Not gonna overfill it this time. <laughs> uh, Steve, should I put a little less water in it? Yeah. Why are you guys thinking a little less? It's only a 15 pound batch. Oh, it's a small batch, huh? What was that look, huh? <laughs> Does it feel lighter? Yes, it does. <laughs> yes, it does. Turn it on right now. Sure. Right, right up. Got the cream powder. Yep. This has been your idea for a while, right? Can we mix it up like cream? No, you don't, have, you don't have to. Let's put the thumb on your dinner. And you have it tipped just a little bit so that it'll no, actually reach. See the handle, see this handle and stuff? You yeah. can't put it on there. You're putting it over the handle. You want to keep it. Keep this away from it. Okay, well, then you got to turn this. To see the handle here, you, you're putting that oh, onto the handle. handle. Oh, okay. Oh, you're just like putting it onto that yeah. thing. Yeah. So instead of, you know, we'll have to lean it a little bit because it's yeah. a small batch. Yeah. yeah. Otherwise, the candy won't touch the thermometer. Yeah, talk to it, you won't. <laughs> so you won't know. You burn it. <laughs> no point in that. Yeah. That stage. So, do the smaller batches usually come up to temp quicker? Oh yeah. Okay, I guess they would. Yeah. yeah. We want it to be thick. So that's probably good, right? Yep. That's good. So that's just chocolate and confectioner sugar. I can't tell you. Keep stirring it because of the chunks. Though. Keep stirring it, kid. <laughs> the chunks are the problem. The chunks are sugar. So we really want chunks of sugar. Yeah, the chunks are pretty much gone. They're gone. They're just little lumpies. Well, lumpies. that's what I mean, the little lumps. We don't want the lumps. That's lumps of sugar. I want lumps of sugar. You're, you're, you're a lumpy. Yeah. <laughs> so that three, uh, three quarters of a shot? You want yeah. that, Max? Do you need help? Uh, you need help? <laughs> it's a half a shot for 15 uh, pounds. I'm good. Yeah. Because okay, so. the peppermint's very strong. Oh, that can smell it. Oh, I thought you said you guys were doing spearmint. Oh, whoa, I got the peppermint. <laughs> yeah, <it's> you too? <laughs> mm hmm. 
Good thing you guys got the exhaust on now, right above everything. <sighs> yeah, clear my sciences. sciences right now. <laughs> Actually, I should get a good whiff too. Because I just had a sinus infection not too long ago. You left in this by yourself? Am I left in this? I don't know who's doing this. Yeah. Joey, Joe, Joey, Joe, Joey. Little Joe. Okay. Oh yeah, I feel it in my eyes. <laughs> my <laughs> eyes go crazy. <laughs> <laughs> Where's your head? All right, ready? Okay. Right. Watch your head. So I decided what it's gonna be. It's gonna be pretzels. Yeah. Oh. Uh. Yeah. There's like a medium-sized bin full of uh, chips. Not like half of a Right. Right. Yeah. I mean, has that been done before? Uh, nothing chocolate like this? Yeah. Nice to be putting it in a jerk and I hope this experiment works. Yeah. I hope it tastes better than the chocolate covered cheese. Yeah. <laughs> um, did you already add sugar? Put two cups in. It's starting to look like brown mix. I figure if it's holding, put it back in the school. Can you taste the difference? Should we use milk since it doesn't really seem like a white milk? Or the taste no, I think, I think it looks good. It's pretty good. Yeah. Can't be too chocolatey, can it? I mean, it's probably not to the people we're selling it to. It's a nice color. Very amber. Here? Maybe we'll just take a small piece off for a red stripe. That's the color of my energy. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> the bubble that wouldn't pop. It just keeps going. You just that's cool. I wish you could have seen that from this side. Oh, yeah. the, the like warm stuff that it's like over the cold stuff, you know? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Neato. It was neato. How neato was it? You know how you can tell? Wow. Tell us. The way it is. Oh, that's awesome. Got him. Ladies and gentlemen. Oh, yeah. Classic. Yeah, that was better the first time. Try it again. <laughs> <laughs> there we go. Little run. <laughs> I put it right there for you. So it was nice and convenient. You gotta do it like kind of early if you're gonna do that one. Max says. That's a Terry rule. Hmm. Well, I guess it's technically a Greg rule. Yeah. Greg teached Terry. Terry teached Steve. Steve teach viewers. The circle of life. <laughs> is complete. It is kind of a circle. Wow. A blob of life. My finger! <laughs> <laughs> that's how Max lost the top <laughs> part of his index finger. <laughs> Look, it comes off. <sighs> oh, how do you do that? 
Oh my god. Oh my god, how did the top index finger look like your thumb? All how kids, you all kids, if you're watching it's this, so look away. <laughs> Too graphic for younger viewers. Who's getting de de demonetized? <laughs> <laughs> oh, I heard recently that, uh, you know, so the ads that go before videos depend a lot on what your content is about. So if we talk about real estate and um, oh, if we talk about. Uh, you know, expensive things. You want to buy an expensive car, you want to buy expensive property, I'll get more money per ad. So really? let's talk about houses, guys. Gold. <laughs> I was Seven. thinking about buying a couple Jaguars. of Jaguars. Yeah. The Jaguars, I like those. Yeah. That's nice. I, I prefer a McLaren, though, I gotta tell you. <laughs> yeah. Mm. It's, it's more about the status than the car. Right. Absolutely. Yeah. So, yeah. Yeah, I, I got a couple dollars. of those back at my mansion. Do you? <laughs> yes, yes I do. Your yeah. car mansion, right? <laughs> yeah, yeah, not the truck yeah. mansion. Oh, yeah, car mansion. <laughs> yep. Okay. <clears throat> How's this ready? Yeah. Are you? No. Oh, boy. That's steep. Really? I've never even heard ready as a name. Please. What? Hi, ready. You sure you know I'm dad? dad. Hi, pregnant. <laughs> Hi, pregnant. I'm gonna be dad. What about? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh. What's it supposed to get to? It's, it's not. You don't know yet because it's the first time. Yeah. What supposed to go to? 108.7, actually. 108.7. Oh, I went down to 107. I'll throw this one away and get. Oh, okay. All right. Here, do you think the people at home want to taste it? Yeah. Here you go, guys. <laughs> <laughs> no, you didn't see it. That was close. <laughs> Sam, you want to taste this one? Will you tell me? Will you get anything? Like more did sugar? You, did you, uh, what is this? It's just sugar and chocolate. <laughs> chocolate. Just chocolate. extra sweet chocolate. Oh, she touched it, gross. Uh. <laughs> I got that out of the drain. It's chocolate. It's really thick. Yeah. yeah, it's supposed to be thick. All right, so because we'll of confectioner sugar. So is it kind of like batter? Like brownie batter? Yeah. Uh, all right. That's <laughs> what we were going for. Cool. Perfect. So it tastes like chocolate? Mm -hmm. Cool. You done done it. Good. Hey, nobody's there to guard you, so drop it. <laughs> drop it? Just drop it? Is that what drop you said? Drop it and nobody gets hurt, he said. Well, drop it like it's hot? It is hot. Did you grease the hook? I sure did. Nobody oiled it. With what, man? With what? Somebody's gonna get that. No, they won't. Nobody will get that. 10W30. Yeah. yeah. WD40. I, I used to write oil on everything. Doesn't help. You don't get one the oil, oil can maybe, out. I don't know. Marvel Mystery Oil. You don't see that much anymore. That's good stuff. Yeah. Can you still play with silly shrimp? <clears throat> Got a can of it in my cupboard. Yeah. Right. One time we went down. Don't want the kids to find it. <laughs> yeah. Dude, they wouldn't even sell it to us. Then you won't be able to play with it, huh? Yeah, play with it when they're not around. <laughs> the kids come home. Dad, you played with silly string without us? <laughs> no, I didn't. I have like a silly string wig on. <laughs> I don't know what you're talking about, son. That's my normal hair. You spray silly string indoors. Everybody's gonna know for the next three days. <laughs> you guys ever seen those? Uh, I think they're usually on Christmas lights and it says for indoor and outdoor use only. <laughs> like, where else are you gonna use it? <laughs> no underwater use. <laughs> yeah. That still has gotta be inside or outside, though, right? Inside or outside the water. <laughs> it looks like you need a little hammer. Go. Ooh. It's good. from this side. Yeah, that's good. I mean, that's a lefty. A left-handed hammer? What, so you weren't expecting good stuff? I'm trying to think of like anybody famous who's left-handed. You! You and you Brad. Are, you guys are famous, yeah. Hmm. 
Uh, I'm sure everyone in the comment section will let us know who's the famous left-handed person. If you ever have any com if you ever have any questions, as long as you're patient, you can just mention it in a video and your question will be answered. If only I had Google in my pocket. Yeah, if only. <coughs> Pretty good. Phil. Give it a whack. Twenty minutes will be done. It's still a little bit weird that we're making hard candy, and especially peppermint flavor, in the middle of June. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Like, growing up, I just yeah. always associated this with, like, Christmas time. You don't stretch about that. I'll just keep you kind of here. You it's kind of like just yeah. giant pieces of hard candy. We cut this in half. We'll one. Cut we'll anyway. do, do this. Cut it in half. Oh, yeah. Shoot, because we can't do the triangle. Okay, so we gotta do flat, half. flat one piece. This one would be flat. Okay. I'm trying to do the triangle on this or something. And then yeah, I'll try to hmm. Okay. Why don't we do them two two halves like this and then we'll just shape we'll just shape, shape it, it as yeah. yeah. Okay, go, go ahead and put the chocolate in there. Okay? Yep. Think about it, it doesn't have a handle. Yeah, oh yeah, <laughs> I didn't think about that. Huh? Nope. That's thick. Does that look good? Push it up a little bit, yeah. Okay, okay. Sure that's good. In there. <laughs> okay, I'll, with, I'll get the one. So you put a little bit of water on the glove? Yep, and then it sticks better. It's like candy glue. Yeah, candy glue. Just water. <laughs> Just add water. <laughs> it's that easy. Now you guys are just trying to make your own triangle. Yeah. <laughs> I just tried yeah, doing just this. Flat. See how it goes. Okay. It's in, it's in there. Yeah. Okay. Hey, yeah, we got a seal. Okay. Uh, yeah, you got it now. I want to say first time's a charm, but they might jinx you guys. <laughs> not this morning, it wasn't. I say, <laughs> knock on wood. And hopefully the hairdressers aren't like, what do you guys want? <laughs> <laughs> this one's kind of hard, just, just a heads up. Okay. Well, now that I think of it, they're probably used to you guys banging on the wall and not saying. Yeah. Share <laughs> the hammer all the time. What are you guys doing over there? <laughs> this is going to be interesting. Yeah, no matter what, this is going to be interesting. No pressure. For your fire. <laughs> Time off. You're going to have to go home for the day. Okay, well, oh, so not that. Try that one. So are you going to do the pretzels or yeah, some kind of? Yeah, try. <laughs> yeah, they'll probably need to be longer. Longer? Beautiful. Just like a real pretzel. <laughs> Actually, that's pretty good size. Okay, so. I don't know if there's any. Let's try that again. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. It's a pretty pretzel, but it's a pretzel. <laughs> yeah, no one taught you how to do it. You just went, like, well, I guess that looks like a pretzel shape. Yeah. Learned on the fly.
got one that actually looks like a pencil. I thought that was a one. Yeah. Yeah, for right now it looks like your like your pieces are just too long on the end. But well, see, that one came out perfect. Yeah, yeah. This, this one looks. It's it's, it's like with the. Just like with the canes, where you just have to get the thumbs in the right spot. You yeah, know, it's not. It's and I noticed too. You just uh, too short? No, they're they're good. It's I just got to get the twist down. Yeah. Oh, okay. There's nothing more pretzel shit. Well, people get ones with the really long yeah. tails. They'll know yeah, what part of the bash they got. Yeah. <laughs> All the same size. So. Yeah. Because they just got Yeah, one side's so thick. Yeah. <laughs> Beautiful. Did you still chocolate in there? Yep. Yeah? Yeah, yeah. All the way in? Yep. All the way in. Just a little bit. Yeah, still getting on my gloves and stuff. Oh, yeah, you can see it right in there. Yep, it's in there. You can see it in the dark. Zach, do you want to be on the channel at all? Sure. Okay. Well, you you were the uh, first customer to try the. I personally candy. like it a lot. Yeah. Um, I think people um, here locally and around the world would like it. Yeah. Um, I'm not sure what it's called. <laughs> yeah, we don't know either. <laughs> but yeah, I like it. I think it would sell a lot. You're a good spokesperson, Zach. <laughs> So is it, so is it going to be in that form when you sell it? Like we were thinking of, thinking of doing this uh, for Christmas time for candy canes. But for now we thought we'd try to experiment just to, so we could sell them. I don't think people buy candy canes, so. I mean, honestly, I've like trick-or-treated and I've gone to the house. And oh, you guys yeah. do it in the basement. Yeah. Yeah. And I've gotten chocolate oh. and you guys have sold it like, yeah. like, for Halloween and all that. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Yeah, all the kids like coming there. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. How was a convention? Not really convention, more of a trade Yeah, it was a convention, yeah. I think that's what we called it anyway. But it was fun. I mean, you guys knew more of, like, people were there talking candy. It was going over my head. Oh, you watched the video? Yeah. It was, uh, it was fun. Time. Personally, yeah. I've never been to Connecticut. So. Yeah. It's a lot like New York. Yeah, yeah. It's, it's really nice. As far as how it looks, anyway. I think. See, when people come from different states and have different countries, they think New York, New York City. Yeah, yeah, right, yeah. 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 They don't think like a little, little village like this. Yeah, so right. If you look at a state in New York, it's mostly farm. Like, yeah, it's just like mostly farm, farm mostly yeah. forest. It's like, like when I tell my friends, because I have a lot of internet friends, they're like, well, you're, you're in New York City, it must be so cool. I'm like, no, I'm nowhere near New York City. I'm like four to six hours from there. It's totally yeah. good. Now, oh, the chocolate. I have a question. It's all chocolate. Yeah, it's all sealed. Nothing around here like that. Anything under two inches? You don't need to wear a restraint. Really? Mm -hmm. I thought it. Yep. Yeah, like yeah. there was one video where Joe, he had a beard that was longer than two inches, so he had to wear a beard now. Did you hear about that guy that was hurling insults at Terry? No, oh, I didn't hear about that. Oh, he died from dysentery. Wait, wait, that's tough stuff. Dang. I guess it'll probably ship, right? Yeah. Where's the hammer? <laughs> Where's the hammer? Yeah, that's a good scenario where you could use it. And, okay, there's the chocolate. Kind of swirled in there a little yeah. bit. Okay. I thought it would be in the middle, but that's kind of neat. Yeah. You guys can see this is the cross section. It's not as interesting as I mm. thought it would be. Well, it's that's really good. Yeah, look at this one. It's all on the top. Mm-hmm. Where? It's kind of neat. All the chocolate's on like. That's really good. It does need more. Wait, wait, hold on. It just focused when you moved it. Yeah. <laughs> It tastes really good, but it does need more um, corn or peppermint flavor. Yeah, so more corn time, flavor. Next time, <laughs> we'll put more peppermint in there. But the chocolate's good. Boy, it comes through. Yeah. Do you taste the chocolate a little bit more than the peppermint? Yeah. Because next time we'll have to add more peppermint. Yeah. Well, like, well, like you guys are saying, it was pretty experimental. And you guys did like a half batch. Um, no, less than that. Only, less than that. Okay. Only a fifteen pound pounds. batch. Okay. Yeah, that's great. Yeah, I can tell though. 
Is more more peppermint? peppermint flavor. And then with the chocolate, it's going to be awesome. I think they blend really well together. Yeah. It's like not too peppermint-y, not too chocolatey. Mm -hmm. Tastes like a York patty. Wait, watch it. Can you watch the temperature for me? Yep. Okay. What type of bag is this for everyone at home? Anybody who's doing these at home must use a 703 bag. 703, okay. Yeah, that's what I've always done when I do peppermint pretzels. Mm, peppermint party pretzels? Pe well, no, the party pretzels would be a small pretzel. I mean, you could have a party with these pretzels, but then I guess it would be a party pretzel. But pretzel party. We're just going for the double alliteration, not for the triple alliteration. The triple threat? Yeah, that's, that might be more than people can handle. You're going more for double jeopardy? Yeah. And triple threat, yeah. Yeah, I don't know what a triple threat is. What, the heck? what is that? Oh, looks like it's just uh, uh, missing something. Like, looks like it's missing chocolate. I wasn't, I wasn't here for this blessed event, so I wasn't. I don't know what's going on. Although I do see some, looks like some chocolate poking through. Yeah. That darkness there. Looks like it's some chocolate. So you decided to do two in each one? Yes, because then we'll be done twice as fast. <laughs> <laughs> That's math. Yeah. I'm surprised you didn't know that. Oh, yeah. Really yeah a little bit of chocolate, chocolate seepage. Chocolate smudge. No, just look at a smudge of some sort. So, Dad just wanted to try this today because he's been meaning to do it. I'm like, well, we got everyone here. He's been wanting to do this for years. So, today his dream came true. He made these pretzels and then he jumped in his car and he took off. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that, that's usually the routine when he's done with hard candy, right? Yes. Because it's so, so much more strenuous on him. Yes. And dehydrating. Yeah. He's probably home right now, hooked up to an IV of beer. Water. <laughs> he takes. He tends to take his beer by mouth. Yeah. Gotta taste it. Yes. So just to make you happy, I will uh, staple a couple of these. Will that make you happy, Craig? I think it'll make the viewers happy. Yes. And this is a hard candy, so. Got to get it done right away. Don't want it to be getting sticky. Mm -hmm. It seems very Christmassy. Yeah, it does. Except we probably won't have time to make these at Christmas, so <laughs> get them now. So, yeah, these would be a fantastic stocking stuffer. We just probably won't have them. Yeah. So I wonder if Dad will. Well, because Dad said that he wanted to make the candy cane ones around Christmas time. Yeah, filled candy cane. Yeah, he yeah. does. He does want to do that. That's what I want to test out this time. It worked out really well. Well, Max want to make them. Max want to make what? You What'd Max, you do, Max? Max might not want to make the candy cane. Oh, he might want to. Wanna, he might just want to make the pretzels. So he's going to check with Max. Right, yep, Max? Call up to me. Yep. Oh, I got a oh, smudged thumb. Geez, Golly okay. gee, gumpers and oh. fiddles. Oh, oh, I don't have to all that out. I'm sorry. Whoa. It's hard to control oh. myself. Golly gee, gumpers. I said the G word. You don't need oh, you to could go that. repeating that language. Woo. Yeah, oh, we heard it. Six, you heard me? Fun juice. Saying the B word and the F word uh -huh. on the video. She's a loo. Who you call the cootie queen? You lick liquor. All right, if you're going to go that far. Do you have uh, other stickers and stuff ready that have to go on them yet? or? No, Not these yet. were just invented. Yeah, I, no, uh, I no. didn't know that I was going to be coming up with labeling today. Yeah. So it doesn't have a skew yet. Yeah, you but just made it in print shop. Yes. 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 All of them, really? Mostly all of them, yes. Mostly Mostly all. Um, are there any that you get shipped? Is that like stickers right? or anything? Yeah, I get a few things done here and there. Things that like you make a lot more of? Yeah, things that like I, that are on a metallic gold background. Like a metallic gold sticker, yeah. Yes. But that's the beauty of having a really tiny business is you can just go, hey, let's make a candy. Okay. Right. right. Hey, let's make a label. Okay. Exactly. I got to tell you, back in the day, um, personal, they were called personal computers. It really changed everything because it used to be if you wanted something like this, you had to pay to get a plate charge. And, yeah. Uh, it was a big deal. So you couldn't just, you didn't just run off 100 or something and try it out, see how it went. Yeah. You, you had to commit. Mm -hmm. So this makes it much quicker to get things to the market. Like, so I didn't even know I was going to be coming up with this today. But yeah. But, because these would be awesome also in raspberry. Yeah, I'm sure. Orange. And I was saying to Dad, like, you know, there's no reason that we can't do it with a vegan chocolate, right? None that I can think of. The vegans could have it, lactose intolerant people. Right. 
And plus we do we made this with dark chocolate because it's chocolate mixed with confectioner sugar and we thought that the confectioner sugar might lighten it up a little bit. Mm -hmm. So we used dark chocolate, which the vegan chocolate is dark chocolate. Yeah. So it's kind of already and also it kind of cuts the sweetness because you yeah. gotta figure the um, That's that what I thought the main reason was because yeah. I thought the milk chocolate would be too sweet. Because I know you guys don't do milk chocolate for the old fashioned uh, cream drops. What is it, the vanilla drops? Cho yeah, chocolate, chocolate drops, drops yeah. I always want to call them vanilla drops because that's what you their can, flavor is. <laughs> I mean, that people call them that. I call them chocolate drops, cream drops. We know what they mean. Yeah. <laughs> All right, let's see one more staple for the road. Okay, I think I can. I think I can. Don't forget to burp it, Mom. I was born burping. Burping, <laughs> Yep. Wow, I'm going to do burp. Well, well you still can. Well, Ta-da! Good work, Mom. Thank you. I try hard and I eat right. <laughs>